There's also foods and drinks that deplete potassium, so coffee. And so don't just think about now, think about across your whole life. How much coffee or caffeinated teas have you, have you used in your life? And are you dumping accidentally, obviously dumping potassium? Alcohol impairs kidneys' abilities of handling the electrolytes. So again, you might not drink, be drinking anything now, but when you were a teenager, did you binge on alcohol? Do you have the times in your life where you had high alcohol? Times in your life where you had a high sodium processed food diet. Again, you're shifting the sodium potassium ratio. You might have um, had excess refined sugar. This is gonna trigger insulin and shift potassium as well. If you've been on this journey for a while and you've tried a lot of different supplements, if anybody ever put you on excess licorice root, some licorice root is good, but excess licorice root can lower your potassium. So again, you have to be very careful with it. Another way to look at this is if you don't do well with licorice, it could be because your potassium is low.